like if I'm with Kurt, I'm trying to keep him from close. Let's say you don't have your stick for a second. This actually, believe it or not, happens. I mean, it happens in reverse too. But most of the time we train to be this guy. How do you go close on a guy with a stick? Oh, you did it. All right? So today, how do you keep a guy from closing on you when you have the stick? Because it's a natural thing for him to want to close. Unless he's going to take off and get some buddies. He either has, he either lets you wail on him, which is a bad thing for him, or he closes, which stops it. Because if he gets inside here, I might do this. Yeah, and that's why I say have this. Bam, make sure you're hitting targets. So he's going to have to smother. If you get in this position, smother my, yes, make sure you smother my stick, because otherwise, otherwise I'm going to hurt you. Yeah, that's what you do. Now my stick is kind of, yeah, you could do this. You won't have time. Trust me, you won't have time. If a guy like, like Kirk gets me in underneath here, he's going to be tripping me. Next thing I know, I'll be on the ground, that sort of thing. So boom, boom, boom. These little knocks in the head, you that? <laughs> nothing. Right? And that's about what it's going to feel like. Right? <laughs> because I've gone with Kurt and I've done that to him, and it's not, I know it's quite time. So, and, and vice versa. So, what you have to do as the guy with the stick is to make sure that number one is you establish your range. And the way you establish your range is you have a killer shot. You don't have to have 10 killer shots, you need one. That's all. Get it though, because too many people are going to be, they think they fly like this. That won't hold off a fly. What you have to do if someone is trying to, if you feel someone coming, you have to move. You have to make sure it's coming in. So when you come in, just like that. And there's like, like that. Make sure something flies in front of his face that gets him in the here and now. Not, oh, I'm going to close. It's like, whoa, I better be careful. That's what you're waiting for. It's strategy, basically. Because if you don't show, you don't want to show everything. But you want him to know if he doesn't block your shot, he will get damaged. He may not get knocked out. He may not get a broken bone. But something that he came in that he was counting on will be gone. 